Ron Howard, Nicole Kidman, Dustin Hoffman, they're all there. Kevin Spacey's as close to me as you are. I love you. Let me up, oh, so We're here. Let's feed the chimps. Not if you want to get paid. <laughs> of course. Vance, 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 oh, Vance, sorry, Vance. This is for you, man. This is for you right here. Featuring the team. Thank you, Vance, but, but, but no, this is written for you. It's got Oscar written all over it. But, 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 Vance. Vance, Vance, honestly, trust me on this one. This is golden. One moment. Rupert. Yes, Mr. Rose. Apparently, somebody has rudely taken an all-out shit on the carpet. Not a problem, Mr. Rose. I'll get that clean up for your right away. How patient or intensive care? How patient? I don't know. What do you suggest? I suggest intensive care. Very thoughtful of you. Intensive care, then. This is really unfortunate. You've got some fucking nerve. Me? You're the asshole here. She can't even hear us, for Christ's sake. You can really hurt me, do you? Like when you told your mom you were dating Gabriella. Well, at least Gabriella earned an honest living. She was a fucking whore, Jack. I mean, she was a piece of trash. Okay, and you don't think you hurt my mom when you decided to tell her you were going to be bisexual? <laughs> All right. She made a noise. Right now? No, last Tuesday. I, I think I know what happened. See, I was picking from the bottom of the stack. Cause that's where you hide the good ones, Red. Anyway, the watermelons came tumbling down on me. And this fella here, the hero is what he is, leaped to my rescue. <laughs> Hi, you wanted to see me? Uh, Mel Ellis, Melina's husband. I see you work out. Well, I try to get to the gym as often as I can, but I'm sure that's not why you're here. Uh, yeah, my wife was a little shy about telling you herself, but she's switching doctors. I'm sorry to hear that. I've enjoyed having your wife as my patient. What? <laughs> what? What's that supposed to mean? She's a nice person. Look, is there a problem with my work? Oh, no, no, no. She thinks you're fine. Fine. I mean, she thinks your work's fine. It's just that she wanted to find a doctor who was a little closer to ugly. Home. Home. Uh, uh, thanks for everything. Peace. Whoa, whoa, 
whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, let's see what we've got here. Breaking and entering, destruction of property, your family has filed assault charges, that's beautiful. And you have over 3,000 counts of computer theft. You're in a serious amount of trouble. In order to save this office the time it would take to convict you in trial, we're offering six to 15 years in a medium security facility. My client has a uh, psychological disorder, one that I can Look, prove. There will be no other deals made, Mr. Ludlow. This is our final and only offer. <laughs> Before you commit to that, there's something I think you want to see. You might want to reconsider. I made a lot of copies of that tape. Uh, you said your client has a psychological problem? <clears throat> okay. Would you call it an addiction? Most certainly. How about three months in a specialized rehabilitation center? He would have to do the total three months, very light time. And if he fails to do so, then he would have to do serious time. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Tristan? Deal. <laughs>